this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy Tactics! Let's head on over to the next town on the way to Riovanes Castle. Since last time, I've changed my setup just a little bit. Uh, well, actually, the only thing I changed was... Yeah, I'm gonna use her. I equipped time magic on Otaku. I've shown you Leviathan now, but as you can tell, it is pretty damn abusive. Of course, you could say that about any number of things in the game, but, you know, I want the battle to take more than two minutes. Or, you know, kill enemies less than five at a time. So, and there are other ways that are even more obscene than that. You think Leviathan's powerful, viewers? <laughs> oh, you should see some of the other ways that you can become obscenely powerful in this game. <laughs> this game is so broken. <laughs> Oh, it's a girl who looks kind of like the other guy. Malik. That's a weird name. Who's the Grand Duke? Has there ever been a Duke that was good in a uh, work of fiction? I mean, you see all these Dukes and they're always evil. Something about heaven and hell skill. They're totally worthless. It's like, why would he burn down a village to get those skills? Of all magic skills to get, I mean, why not go for summons or something like that? I mean, heaven and hell skill? Well, you'll see how they work in this game. What did he do to you? Don't answer that, viewers. Apparently there's some kind of argument going on here. They got ninjas and summoners on their side? Holy cow. I'm totally unprepared for them. Now, nah, nah, this will be pretty easy because all of them, they're going to be kind of bottlenecked there. Sure, mysterious girl that I haven't known for more than two minutes. Why not? Got to get my booty duty somehow. I like the, uh, what is she wearing there? A headdress or something? I don't know. And, yeah, we gotta save her. Uh, make sure she doesn't die. Oh, that was pretty lucky on my part. Usually they'll throw, well, much more powerful things. Oh, this could hurt. Ow. Yeah, ninjas can throw elemental balls at you. Uh, they got some other things, too. Uh, shurikens. I prefer throwing axes, because axes have really high attack power, and, well, you can buy a lot of them, so, although I haven't been using them a whole lot, I've been sticking mostly to, uh, Earth Slash. Now, what they're using there is their, uh, their magical skill called Heaven and Hell skill. Uh, the, what they do is they, you select a range for them to target just like any normal spell, except it hits random targets in that radius, which is pretty bad, because as we all know, anything that is random in an RPG is bad, except for him, the Torak, that's different. Yeah, what are you doing out here? And, oh, who are the Shrine men? Well, I suppose we'll find out eventually. Well, at least I got through the dialogue quickly enough. Lucky me. Yeah, we're doing good on HP there. Let's try and line up here and get haste going on everyone. We could use the help. The summoners won't be able to get over here in the first round anyway. Yeah, enemy summoners, usually not something to worry about too much finish off the other two ninjas while we're at it. Yeah, I was thinking, eh, maybe I could mix it up with the elemental skill, but nah. Thank you for lining up single file! Anytime. Don't want to get too clustered up in a row, you never know. That ninja there could have something annoying to, deal with, or to use on us. 
Yeah, you see, it's hitting random tiles in whatever range she targeted, and yeah, I, I hate the skills. I hate things that are random. The game is random enough as it is. Come on! What are you going to do now? Oh, that could be bad. Oh, maybe I can silence one. Whoa, that could be really bad. Well, let's see what summons are using, at least. Shiva and Shiva. Twin sister Shiva? No, nah. no, nah, just, just ordinary Shiva. Well, I can silence one of them. Let's see what their faith is so I can get a better idea. Ugh. Ugh. It's not looking good either way. Well, the reason I like teleport for this battle is because I can teleport right through walls there. So that could be pretty useful. Ooh, 29%. Which means that it's going to work. Absolutely. Woohoo! Why does that work? That should not work. Things with a 30% chance of success do not work in real life. 30% of the time, it works 100%. Well, I can take out that ninja. And that's what I'm going to do. Sorry, buddy, but I have to borrow your soul! There we go. Don't worry, I have to worry about her. Cheer up, Krona. Kill more summoners. Beat them up like a disobedient hooker. Maybe I can silence the other one? Dang kids, get off my lawn. Got some noisy kids trying to... I don't know what they're doing. Aw, oh, man, she's not going to do the raise the roof animation now. Nuts. I always like that animation when they're confused like that. They always have weird confusion animations in these games. Okay, come on. Okay, very good. Hmm. Maybe haste yourself up, I guess. I can't even hit the other summoner. Oh well. Now we don't need to stay away from the summoner. They're going to have to stay away from my summoner. Yeah, let's take her out. Whoa! Getting a little excited there, Krona. I mean, I know I told you to cheer up and everything, but yeah, I didn't know I'd perk you up that much. You're just... Oh, you're confused. I was like, what are you doing? What is she doing? She's casting... Moogle? Huh. Well, whatever. Whack her upside the head. You need the levels anyway. Or you could just wait around. Why not? Hit her with your rod or your katana. I think that's the first time I've attacked with a katana. Well, easy enough. Yeah, it's nice when all the enemies uh, line up single file. Makes life a lot easier. Ah, I thought the chapter was supposed to get harder here, but I guess I was wrong. Yay! Victory music! It's too bad we're not getting anything useful from these battles anymore. Like, they were doing pretty good at first. They were handing equipment to us left and right. Now it's like, who cares? Huh? Oh well. Hey, how's it going? Keep an eye in the upper left corner of the screen, viewers. Weapon King. Do you like the Lizard King? No. No, he just has weapons and stuff. He would? Huh. That's kind of weird. How does that line of succession work? I've got nothing better to do. Revenge? That's our motivation in every other Final Fantasy game. 
Uh, it's not going to do you much good with... Well, I suppose if you kill all the other Bialves. Yeah, that might work. You'd have a nice big castle all to yourself. Oh, yeah, I suppose so. Still got it. Well, you escaped, so that's it. You can move along now. What are you guys doing anyway? You're looking... Th oh, I was like, looking through dead bodies for food? Well, I, I guess... I guess when they're all dead, you, all you can do is just look through your pockets for spare change. Uh, somehow having skills that hit enemies at random does not seem like a good skill for assassins. I, I don't know. M maybe that's just me. M maybe I'm the one that's crazy. Yeah, so they call them like heaven and hell skill or magic or... Something or other like that. I've never really used them that much, if at all. So, I don't... Yeah, I don't know much about them. Well, how old were you? I mean, how could you not know? How did you find the truth? I don't think they ever explained that. What the? What was that? Oh, okay. Yeah, you see a little shadow there? It's a frog! Oh no! A frog! I hate frogs! No. No. I thought it was like gonna walk on the screen, but uh, I guess not. It just kind of suddenly appears like that. Well, that's rather direct. Yeah. It doesn't seem like the best plan. If you kill her, then you know I will be able to kill you. Well, they kind of already had her to begin with anyway. This message will... Oh, yeah. Well, thanks for uh, coming along with us, I suppose. All right, that's everything we can do there. Uh, I don't think there's anything more we can really uh, learn as far as abilities go, but after this battle, there is some new equipment to get, uh, particularly uh, a platinum sword that I can get for Agrias. Uh, let me save here, because there is one thing that I want to show you that I uh, already made another save file for to demonstrate. Now you see here, go to the bar, we got proposi new propositions here at this town. There's only one. See, it's June 18th right now. Let's uh, fast forward about a week or so. Eh, a little over a week. Okay, fair enough. But the thing is, is that there are some propositions that only show up at certain times of year. In this case, I've intentionally set it up so that way I can get the win the Yarda fight. Uh, proposition. It's only available sometime towards the end of June. I don't know the exact date range. I've seen different websites that have different date ranges. I've heard some say it's certain zodiac periods of the year, or some say that the game has the zodiac dates wrong, or something or other. I've heard so much conflicting information, I don't know what's real. But I do know that it is available now. So I'm going to take care of some extra propositions, get some new equipment, and then we'll continue on to R Rio Vane's Castle next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy Tactics. This is H.C. Bailey signing off. Have a good day.